hi you are welcome to the channel we are making in this video asparagus with gnocchis so let's get started here i have my asparagus nicely washed and clean i'll go ahead at this point i have the baby ones i'll go ahead and divide them into four okay so cut them into any shape you want or divide it into any amount that you want okay so after dividing it i put it aside i'll go ahead and cut my cherries okay my cherry tomatoes i'm just dividing it also into two just like so and then i'm going to set it aside i'll go ahead now and chop my onions okay we are adding a little onions for the flavor so i'm going to chop it very fine so there we have it i'm going to set them aside here I have water, I'll go ahead and add my asparagus and add salt. We are going to boil it for just 2 minutes. Into my pan I added now oil and also chopped onion. Back to the asparagus, it's been 2 minutes, so I'll take it off, okay? Onion, I'll stay together. There we have our gnocchis. So after some seconds of frying the onions, I'll go ahead and add to the onions. Just as you are seeing, I'll give it a quick stir okay this is very simple and very very easy also to make yeah i also added more of it because it was then too small i'm going to list everything in the description box for you guys to check it out i'll stir everything nicely together to get the flavor of the onion and then i'm also going to cover it for about three minutes okay so after the three minutes i came back and now i'm going to just turn it or stir it together so so simple and very easy now i added a little butter for taste okay or for flavor and then i'm going to stir it together remember we just use very little of oil just because we are coming to use the butter and also we are adding some heavy cream yeah so now the asparagus is ready i added at this point to it i'm going to stir it together so so simple and very very easy We'll also go ahead and add my cherry tomatoes at this point also as well and of course we are then going to add now some salt to this. I also added some vegetable seasoning so at this point add any seasoning of your choice. I will give it a quick stir at this point. So so simple and very easy. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate. If you are new here you are welcome. If you watch the video up to this point i really appreciate don't forget to give the video a thumbs up and don't go anywhere and let's finish it together yeah so after stirring together now i added my double cream or my whipping cream okay i also added now some milk to dilute okay so you can also just use the milk if the heavy cream is too fatty for you okay that is why i just use half half of it okay i just use the milk to dilute it a little bit you can also just use heavy cream or you can also just use the milk yeah so i stay it together i lower my heat at this point and then this is how it's looking like at this point i'm adding my pesto about two teaspoon of it but full okay this is the pesto we are going to stay together the pesto in this dish is kind of a taking agent you see after we mix together it will get thick okay so this is so so simple and very easy you just stir everything together and let it mix with everything and yes believe me everything is ready thank you guys for watching i really really appreciate so at this point you make sure to mix it so well together for the pesto to mix in well with the sauce okay i added now my black pepper of course so and i'm going to mix it also together and then we'll just go ahead and cover it for a minute or two and it is ready the asparagus are baby ones they don't, don't need much time to cook I also cover it and now there we have it our dish is ready our asparagus gnocchis one pot is ready very easy to fix for lunch or dinner 
and you are going to enjoy it hope you're going to give this recipe a try thank you for watching i really really appreciate at this point it's time to just serve it taste for salt when needed you can add if not it's just ready and you serve it okay i'm going to see you guys in my next video don't forget to give the video a thumbs up look at it it looks so so colorful and was very yummy creamy and delicious so we are going to serve it and everyone enjoy this dish okay thank you guys for watching i'm going to see you guys in my next video so then bye bye ciao and i'm using this opportunity to wish my beautiful daughter happy birthday god bless you sweetheart may the good lord bless your new age with long life prosperity and good health you are going to live to see your children's children in good health god bless you sweetheart you are blessed